Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. Today answering one of the Turkish coffee drinking world's most vexing questions. How long does it take to grind a cup of Turkish coffee manually by hand? Now one of the idiosyncrasies of Turkish coffee as a form of coffee consumption is that it uses the most fine coffee grinds of any form of coffee, even espresso. It's actually considerably finer. Now this uh, peculiarity actually means that for the newbie Turkish coffee fan, it's actually more affordable to get going using a hand grinder because because the grind is so fine, when you're looking to get a, a machine ground, you're typically looking at a high-end conical burr grinder, the type you might find in a coffee shop or even in a coffee roastery. So those tend to be pretty pricey, but you can pick up a fairly inexpensive hand grinder from Amazon. I'm using one from uh, sozengrinders.com. I'm pronouncing that wrong. It's a Turkish family owned business. My one did, did come as a little sticker of authenticity. I just uh, removed it because I'm finicky like that. Um, now I'm gonna be using one tablespoon of coffee here and let's see how long it takes to grind. Now, if you like your coffee on the stronger side, some folks will recommend two tablespoons of Turkish ground coffee. You can prepare it on the stovetop method. You can prepare it using a machine like my Arzim Oka Minio, we can see in the background there. Or if you like, you can do what's called the lazy method and just pour boiling water on top of Turkish coffee in a glass and the Turkish coffee is going to sink to the bottom. That's called an Israel uh, coffee bot, which means literally mud coffee. And Turks tend to call it just lazy coffee because it's a lazy preparation method. But, you know, if you're working on a work site and you don't have the liberty to use fancy gear, it's probably fine. So we're about 36, 36 seconds into the grind. Let me show you guys how much I have at this point. We're not there yet. It's kind of probably at the halfway point, half of a table, tablespoon. Um, I'm gonna grind a bit more now. The answer is how do you know how long it takes to grind? You just kind of develop muscle memory. It, th the conclusion of this video, spoiler alert, is that it's gonna take about a minute to get a tablespoon or thereabouts of coffee. So we're at 45 seconds now and I'm just gonna continue until uh, we wrap up here. And 50, stopwatch has stopped at 50 seconds. I'm gonna pour a bit more grounds into the tablespoon measure and you can see how much we have. And I'm going to call this a tablespoon because I dampened it down and that's not something you typically do with Turkish coffee. So you can see it's almost at the top there. It's like 90% full. And if I didn't dampen it, it probably was, I think it was actually all the way there at the tablespoon. So the answer, how long does it take to hand grind Turkish coffee? Well, it's going to depend on what manual grinder you have and how fast it grinds. It's going to depend upon how fast you crank the handle as well as probably other factors. But to the simple answer to the question is that it's gonna take between 60 seconds and about two minutes, depending on the quantity of coffee you want. If you're going for one tablespoon and you're using a Sozin grinder, it's gonna take 60 seconds. If you want two tablespoons, double that for two minutes. Hope that was helpful. It's not too much effort, I think, and it makes the whole uh, process of preparing your morning coffee more satisfying and more mindful. Thank you guys for watching. More video about Turkish coffee and other subjects will be coming soon.